All right, y'all, listen, man, this was gonna be one of them fun vlogs with the cinematics on my way to Charlotte, but it didn't turn out that way. So I'm gonna kind of flip it and I wanna show you guys. I know a lot of you wanna be educators and travel and all of that. And I wanna show you guys, sometimes there's an ugly side to traveling. So long story short, guys, some of you may know I drive two hours to the airport all the way to Nashville. And today I got about an hour away and my wife called and I had left my wallet at home. So if you guys don't know, you cannot check into the airplane without your ID. So I had to drive all the way back. Now I'm flying out of my home airport which is super small i'm gonna show you guys when i get there but we're gonna be on like a super small plane it's not a pj guys it's kind of a joke but it is a small plane we're gonna fly to chicago and then fly to charlotte but we're gonna get at it we gotta do what we gotta do sometimes i've had worse trips than this i've had to drive all the way to atlanta after a missed flight before different things like that but that is what comes with being an educator traveling the country sometimes you miss flights sometimes you get flat tires all that kind of stuff happens so anyway i'm home for about 15 minutes we're gonna head to the airport i'm gonna show you guys this small airport this super small plane we're gonna have a longer travel day than we were supposed to but we're gonna get there and get the class done anyway so let's head out and check out this airport all right guys this is it i told you that it's small i see a little small little baggage claim i just opened tsa just for us so let's get to it I guess we made it through probably about, looks like 10 people on this flight. So two TSA agents, super different deal. I'll show you TSA in a second, but here's the PJ. Like I said, not a PJ. Honestly, guys, we used to have like literally an eight seater. So this is, like I said, it's kind of like a private jet, but with regular seats. So I think it's a similar size though, like a Learjet, I think is what it's called. But anyway, funny enough, guys, as bad as my morning's been, I've been kind of looking forward to trying this flight. I haven't booked it, it's a little more expensive. So I always drive to Nashville and this has to connect in Chicago, no matter where you're going. So honestly been wanting to check it out. So today's gonna be the day. So we will hop on here in a minute. I think we leave in 40 minutes and uh, show you guys what it looks like and hopefully we get to Charlotte soon. So we made it kind of a weird trip. We had to get off way far away from the terminal, ride a bus over a shuttle over to the thing. Easy flight, hour flight, but now I gotta make my way through the airport. Supposed to have a nonstop flight. Now I have two hours here. It took an hour to get off the plane, on the bus, over to here. Now I got like two, maybe hour and a half here. I'm gonna spend this whole day traveling. So again, I'm just changed the video, but wanted to show you guys that this is kind of what happens sometimes. And now my trip is gonna turn into day one. Traveling the entire day. I'm gonna get there probably at eight o'clock, get something to eat, go to the hotel, go to sleep, and get up early in the morning teach the class the entire day probably won't eat all day eat after the class go to bed i gotta get up at like 5 a.m do the same thing and uh, i'll get home monday morning at like 8 30 something like that so less than 48 hours in this entire trip just to go do a class but that's what we do so anyway i'm gonna find something to eat find my gate get back with you guys when we get to charlotte all right guys so i roll up to the gate and we pop over here to the screen charlotte AA 2027, delayed and at H8. So I just walked all the way over here, man. It was like 10 minute walk at least, all the way to K and I gotta go back to H. So I'm gonna grab some food while I'm here. I got an extra hour and a half. So <laughs> I guess we're gonna chill. I might work on some videos and we're gonna get to Charlotte at some point. All right, guys, we made it to the hotel. Long travel day. I think it's like 8.30. I can't see it right now I'm recording, but I think it's like 8.30. I left my house at five this morning. Crazy travel day. The airports were crazy as well. That's why everybody's delayed. Drain everybody will get here hopefully within the hour i'm working on this video just watching a little ufc waiting for them but that is probably it for the vlog today i will catch you guys in the morning at the class we got a look and learn in the morning and then a hands-on portion coming after that and i'll see you guys there all right we're here touch of precision beam nate Drayden lost the keys again Being it's early it's early in the morning yeah come on <laughs> he only been up for like one hour but yeah here we go Dre got these chairs last night at one in the morning he uh found this dude on marketplace and got these chairs so we got like 40 chairs we're about to go in here and set up and see what this shop's about <laughs> All right, we kind of set up. Beam's working on his presentation, last minute add-ons. We got a lot of students here, so they got a barbershop and a school. So we got a lot of students here. It's gonna be like 50 plus at the class. So, so we're gonna have the Apple TV up here. Got my tools set up, cutting right here, and all the students right here. Uncle Nate trying to handle. He's all, he's already talking to all the all the guys and yeah. No, 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 that ain't all you are. But yeah, guys, we're gonna uh, about half hour. We're gonna finish setting up and uh, get to this class. 
Nate Dog setting up the the product. What would it be looking like, dog? Hey, as you can see, we do it in categories. So right here, we got our hair styling products, our enhancement line, our innovation line, and our apparel line. What's it looking like though today? Oh, this is looking Show nice. Show them this. Is like, man, we got a packed house, man. They're ready to hear you. You drop some jazz with Poppy B, and I'm just gonna introduce y'all. Yeah, Nate gonna MC. So we're about we got like 10 or 15 people left, and we're gonna get to it. All right, all right, all right. How's everybody doing today? That'd be all right if I was in South Carolina, but I'm in North Carolina. How, how's everybody doing today? Good, man. Hey, listen, man, I just want to make sure everybody's up in the weight, man, because you guys spent your money. You spent your money, so you might as well be present. All right, so for those of you guys that don't know who I am, I'm Nate Motivates on YouTube. My name is Nathan. I'm one of the man district managers for the Headlines Barbershop brand um, that Tune 45 is affiliated with. Um, I'm one of the uh, platform educators for Tune 45, but I'm just blessed. I'm just like you guys. I'm here to be a student. Lucky enough for me, my friends just so, so happen to be some major influencers in the industry, and that's why you guys are here. We got Sean Cuts here, Owensboro, excuse me, Kentucky. Anybody know where that's at? Not me, I didn't know until I met him. That's how small of a town it is, but you know about him. I don't know where you guys are at in your career. I don't know where you guys are stationed at. You can never be too small to make a major impact. Everybody understand that? All right. Then on the other side of the spectrum, we got somebody from the Chirac. All right. This is my buddy, man. He's been cutting hair since he was nine years old. But more importantly, he's always had a heart to give back to the community. That's why he's been so consistent with his YouTube, just like he's been. Both of these guys collectively, they were literally dropping a video during the pandemic almost like every other day. And that's how they've been able to create their influence. So what I'm up here to let you guys know is this. Just be present. How do you be present? Stop giving everybody what you pay for for free on Instagram. Be here. All right, don't be so thirsty to get a clip. Be present. Gain the lives that you came here to pay for. So be present. All right, so if I was you, put this thing on silent. I call these things devices of mass distraction, all right? Don't let your blessing get stole from you because you were scrolling. Secondly, don't be scared to ask questions when the questions um, time arrives. And most importantly, I want to start us off by the right way. I want to thank our, the owner of this shop for even opening his doors and giving you guys this availability and opportunity. So give it up to my man, E. I know he has some of his students in here, some of you guys are a product of his, what he does out here in this community, man, but I think this is major, man. I think this is needed, that we can help each other grow. There's enough room out here for everybody. So without further ado, guys, I'm gonna bring up these two educators, guys. They're gonna really give you guys, one is gonna give you his tips on his enhancement game, the other is gonna give you the whole opposite end of the spectrum. That's why I like these two. It's almost like the yin and the yang, all right? You're gonna get two different sides of, of barbering, but together, it can definitely add some tools to your arsenal, all right? So if you're ready, say I'm ready. All right, so without further ado, put your hands together for Poppy Beam and Sean Cuts here. So that is it for the class just got back to the hotel long day at the class like i said this vlog was kind of about the class but turned out to be about travel we're gonna go eat come back we gotta get up early and travel home so i love what i do guys i'm glad i get to get around the country and teach these classes but i just wanted to make this it happened to be one of those bad trips i wanted to show you guys a lot of this stuff on instagram and youtube is just all the good and i wanted you guys to see the bad that comes with it so anyway guys with that being said we do do private classes for barbershops and salons so if you're watching this and you want us to come to your shop or school or salon talk to your shop owner if you are the shop owner hit up education at 245 and Drake can get you guys set up let you know the possibilities of us coming out there i love traveling the country i love meeting you guys in person doing these classes a lot of people gained a lot of knowledge today and this is what i really love to do you guys know i do it on youtube for free but the hands-on classes the in-person classes are so much more fun to put kind of a face to the name of the people that follow me so hit us up if you're interested education at 245 appreciate you guys watching this video i'm gonna drop another one right here for you guys to check out and I'll catch you guys next time.